the white people that be adopting black children front and center for the lecture. Yes, yeah, white men and white women to the front and center for the lecture. Okay. It is child abuse to meticulously and to intentionally adopt so-called black children and keep them away from black people. Imagine going to adopt a Haitian child and purposefully keeping that child away from Haitian people. Y'all remember when that motherfucking alopecia based sweetener got on this goddamn app talking about, I just adopted a black baby. Her name is Zoe. I don't know what to do for her hair. What the fuck you gonna get them for without doing the research? Okay. There's certain rules that goes into place. Okay. I get it. Y'all want to spend that, but we're all human. You can't raise a so-called black child like you would do your lily white children. There is a fundamental difference. Let me break it down further to you. Let's just say you got a domestic short hair cat in your home, shitting in a litter box. You decide that you want to spice up your life. As a white man or white woman, you want to spice up your life and you go to the wild and get a leopard. Do you think you're going to be able to raise that leopard like you would do a cat, like a domestic cat? They both cats. But this is two different realities. Nobody got a problem with you adopting so-called black children. But if you're not going to do the research, if you're not going to explain to them how the world views them, if you're not going to do the work, then don't adopt them. That's the only problem. And let me tell you something, because I hear a lot of y'all say, it doesn't matter if I raise my kids on love. It does matter because you're not following the rules. You can't love your so-called adopted child if you keep them away from their roots. That's not love. That makes people believe that you have other uh, motives of why you adopted kids. Nobody give a fuck if you adopt so-called black children, but their rules, their research is a difference. And it's okay that we as people have differences and we can respect that. But it, the fact that you want to sit up here and have motherfucking main character syndrome and think it's not about you if you adopting them. They deserve for you to have done a research on what it takes to bring them up in this world. That's it.